B final. In lane one, Caroline Baber, Nova, Virginia. Two is Catherine Purnell from Nation's Capital. Three, Sophie Davis, from, also from NCAP. Top seed in this heat is Lizzie Danforth from Nova, Virginia. Five, Anna Keating, who is the winner of the 200, 200 breaststroke. breaststroke. I know she won something last night. And we did an interview um, with her. Check that out on swimmingworld.com. Maybe our last shameless plug of the meet. <laughs> We need to do some more life lessons with Jason we before we, do, we, do before we finish lessons. here. I'll, I'll see if I can conjure Co up. Come up with something. Yeah, I'll conjure something up. Elizabeth Fry from Eagle Swim Team is in six. Madison Cottrell from Nova Virginia is in seven. And Georgia Johnson in eight. Eagle Swim Team, Elizabeth Fry, six. Nova seven, Madison Cottrell. Then Captain eight, Okay, here's something. Life and, lessons with Jason coming up here. Well, and this is something I think Andrew can probably attest to as well. I, I think in a meet like this where, okay, there's eight – Eight sessions, well, seven, because there's only one session on Thursday night. But still a lot. Still a lot of sessions. Well, even that they're swimming in. There's more, actually, that we've been, that we've here, been for. here for. Yes, but eight if you swim prelims, finals, all that, or seven, whatever. A lot of sessions. Swimming lots of events. It's really, really difficult to remain focused all the way throughout that meet, all the way through these events. And for a lot of ladies here, uh, likely this is their last event, 200 IM. It is their it's last definitely event. definitely their last event. It's the last open uh, event here. So... Andrew, how do you remain focused in a four-day meet or, or a meet like nationals or trials that's like a week long? Yeah, I mean, definitely the ones that are five, six, seven days long, eight days for trials are, um, are difficult. Um, but it's all about just taking it one swim at a time, taking it one session at a time, coming in a plan with your day. You know, I'm going to get to the pool at you know, X time. I'm going to get in to warm up at you know, Z time. This is what I'm going to do for warm up. I've got an hour between my races. This is what I'm going to do between my races. And sort of just planning out and making sure you're knowing what you're going to do and, and sort of helps you tackle it instead of looking at it overall and be like, oh my gosh, there's seven days and 20 swims. How am I going to handle it? If you take one day at a time and plan it all out and sort of set up ahead of the time, um, it makes it much more manageable. And you forget some of the challenges you have to deal with at a meet like this. Cassidy Bear was, was telling me, you know, she swam the 200 fly last night and then the relay. That's three hours, and she didn't get to take her suit off. You know, little things like that, it, it make, makes it tougher. And it's about getting through those little things, staying mentally focused. And you're right, Jason, as we uh, get towards the end. As the winner here, Anna Keating, 204.75. Sophie Davis in 205.78 is second. And Elizabeth Fry is third in the B final, the final women's B final of the meet. Speaking of Cassidy Bear.